everybody how are you doing happy as i say happy friday no oh i wish <laughs> no we're at the other end of the week but it's all jolly here at heavy hq today isn't it morgan's back i'm alive he's alive <laughs> Just about, just about. Every so often, I, I say something really funny, and then she like coughs and coughing fits and dies. We can't have any hilarity no at all. Otherwise, we're going to have to run out and I'm, leave the stream. I'm not sure I can get it. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you going to do today, Morgan? I am going to do a bit of a sort of clean and simple card. A mm -hmm. little bit of ink blending, a couple of critters, and some yeah. some Copic colouring. I've got some grey markers because I have not crafted in a while, so yeah. I thought that's the easiest way it kind of. Get back into the groove. Get into the groove. I like it. Um, and for me, I, on Friday, on my Friday night stream, did a card using koalas, the Quality Hugs uh, stamp set. And, um, you know, I think I might go for more koalas again today. So I have too many. I know. I'm, I'm just really enjoying that. So I think I'm going to go for a lot of koalas again today. Craig has snuck in to do a refocus. So we good? <laughs> Don't bosh your head again. Craig nearly lost his last remaining brain cell. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm Don't very serious for the rest of this stream. Laura Rumbles oh. here. Hello, you two, she says. The good news is it's not contagious. I know, that's good. Plus, Craig was ill for like 10 days. Piper was ill last week. Somebody is insistent in calling me. And then you got ill. Mm -hmm. And I am touched all the wood in the world. Avoid it so much. All the debt, all the wood. All <laughs> disinfected. Okay. All right, so let's grab some stuff. Cool. I have picked out my oxides already. So I have got Salty Ocean and Broken China. Nice. Should yeah. we flip this screen around? Yep. Why not? All right. So here we have Koala the Hulk. I'm going to grab some memo tape. Oh, it's the one it's thing I don't grab. Yeah. And I have got a panel here from the Whimsically Wonky Frames. Mary is here as well. Hello. 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 Um, and I think I'm going to be adding these two little guys that you can't see because I'm off camera. Um, so this little guy, he's like hugging on the side and then this little jolly guy down here too. So I think I'm going to use these guys and it's going to be a birthday card. But I might do a little bit of ink smooshing oh. to start us off. So let's grab some cardstock and I'm going to use some of my the, my favorite cardstock for doing like watercolor stuff which is the paint on the cardstock but I've also got is that what you're using too yeah awesome mm. I feel like I'm less worried about splattering and distressing the distress yeah I agree. On it. I agree so I have started with Broken China and I've sectioned off the top half of my card, except I feel like this pad has seen better days, poor Manny. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, we should talk about the microphone as well. The microphone and the, and the, the echoiness. So yeah, can you tell me about a new microphone? So we got a new microphone. And with the new craft room, there's a lot of flat surfaces. So it's a little bit echoey. We do know we're we've tried to sort of minimise that to a degree. Yes. So um, when I am crafting on my own, I normally have a little lapel mic here, so it's right here. Um, when we were crafting previously, we had a microphone right in front of us down here, but now we have a microphone up top here on the ceiling. So um, it, it's going to sound a little bit different from our previous lives, and it's probably going to take a little bit of time for us. To do some tweaking so please bear with us but feedback is appreciated also means if we're talking morgan and we'll get our heads down we might need a bit, bit lighter oh, is true. up top i don't know if i can be much lighter at the moment so no that's, you're yeah that's you're problem. all right you're <laughs> mary is saying those critters are so cute awesome and distressing all morning my sponges are getting worn out <laughs> This one, that, that one definitely yeah. looks like it needs to go in the bin. I'm going to go for um, a... Can I borrow your broken china, please? Yeah, I can. I'm going to have... Just pop them there. 
I'm gonna. I will get some sheets. Do you want? Uh, oh, you want me to? No, nope, you know? I do not need. That's fine. I'll leave him there. I'm just taking a piece of acetate here. Sure. I'm gonna fold that over. I'm gonna use the corner. I line it up. And then regret my choices. Oh it's no! Wait. Wibbly wobbly, isn't it? I don't want this one because that's oxides, is it? Yeah, do you, you want the ink, don't you? I think I'll have the ink, yeah. I just, I don't know. For blending, I'm all of that's grand, yes, but very much for not smooshing. Person. I want an inky. Jenny says, good morning, ladies from Alabama. Good hey. morning. Mary says, love the rainbow lights in the background. Yeah, we spent a good, a good while sorting out the lights. Trying to get the colours just right. If you have any <laughs> requests, let us know. I'll throw them out for next time. I feel like that's a dangerous thing to start doing light mm, requests. Mm, that's true, probably. Um, so I'm picking, I decided to go for tumble glass in the end because I figured I could always come back in and darken it. That's a good strategy, I think. Mm -hmm. I use the Make Art Station, actually. Okay, okay. So I have picked up some of this ink from my craft mat with a piece of acetate. And laid it down. Oh, some good smooshes going on there. Lovely smooshing. Actually, it doesn't need to be perfect because it's more of a little hint of a colour in the background here. Um, I will come in with a little bit darker. Why not? So you've got the pinstripe stencil. I do, yeah. I like the pinstripe stencil, but it is quite fine. Yeah, so I feel like we could have some wobbling on the go here. Uh, All right, we're gonna try and minimize it though. Do, 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 do. Amy Corson's here. Hi, Amy. Hey, Amy. All right, let's pick up a couple of these little darker drops here. Wash. Can you guys see that? Very light, but I'm gonna pop that to the side. Clean up my table. No, don't move on. And get stamping. Do you know what we need to do with that one and a couple of the others actually is oh. spray it with some Oh the magical sticky stuff. Yeah. Um but to do that I kinda like to do that outside so that I'm not mm. making an absolute mess in the I think that is not live stream that friendly is material. Not really an inside <laughs> job. That's an outside task, you know. Eh, that'll do. I'll leave it kind of whatever it looks like. It'd be fine, it'd be, it'd be fine. fine. It'd be fine. For me, I am moving on to stampering. Oh, next time we're outside, we need to bring in some more. I've managed to go through all of that. Oh, wow. Found one page. Our AMFC. I like how it's become outside, it's not the office. I know. It's it's outside. Out there in the wilderness. No, that's what it feels like sometimes. <laughs> in the winter, Out in yes. the cold. <laughs> <laughs> Mary is suggesting rainbow colours. Do you know what? This technique here with... It's really nice with oh, colours. Oh, so good with rainbow colours. Absolutely. One of my faves. I don't know I'm putting that. I'm going to need to clean that. I did toy with the idea of going with rainbow colours, but actually I'm somewhat inspired by a bunch of cards that Yarla made. Oh, you yeah, can check this. it up on the blog mm -hmm. or on Instagram if you prefer. Um, and she had used patterned paper to do a strip across there to divide your ink section, your white section. So that's what you're going for? That's what I'm going for. Nice. Well, I'll put my moment over there because you'll need that moment oh. early. Do you like what I did there? We're supposed to be having no humour today. I know. <laughs> and yet poorly planned puns are making their way into conversation. Moment of truth. 
Oh, I love a reveal. Love, I love a lot of things, has to be said. Oh, oh, I forgot my birthday cake. Well, okay, I'll come back Your to the birthday cake. Oh, yeah, no. so I pulled out a little birthday cake. So this is actually from the Quill You Be Mine stamp set. She's got this cute little birthday cake. So it has leaves on it. So I thought that was quite um, cute to go with my little koalas. Because obviously, what if you're a koala and you want for your birthday, you're going to have like leaves. Yeah. Yeah. So you're going to have just leaves? Yeah, I think you'd have eucalyptus, uh, eucalyptus flavoured birthday cake, wouldn't you? I can't imagine it'd be very tasty for anyone other than a koala, no, but you know. Anywho, anywho. Bella V. And what I've also got here is a couple of dyes. And this is from the Tremendous Peekaboo Tree Die Set. So I think I'm going to create a little um, a little tree or branch for this guy to not sit on but kind of be around. So let's prep this, shall we? This is going to go on here and I'm going to just colour this in actually. Um, have a wee color. Have a wee color. Have some fun. Wait, to... Timer out. You need to press the button on the door. Oh, hold on. Uh, I'll get the one. Okay, one second. It's not because I'm too short to reach the other one. <laughs> it's absolutely because you're too short. <laughs> okay, we have recommenced the timer. Nice. Mm. So, um, oh, sorry. No, sorry, on you go. I was just going to say that I'm going to go for some sort of more pastel y tones because my car that I made on Friday night was all sort of pastels and I was living for it, guys. Absolutely living for it. So, for my tree branch, I'm going to go for a, quite a light brown. A light brown. Light brown. I think love the wildflowers shape the pad. Yeah, I think I would pick one of my favourites, but actually, do you know what pattern paper pad I've used the most of? No. Fright Night. <gasps> yeah. And I've been doing my, my little bullet journal -y bits, which mm -hmm. to be honest, I've been slacking on because I started doing January and then never actually finished it. Mm -hmm. And I realise now that we are in February. Oh, yeah. So I'm mm, I'm not being very religious with it, let's be honest. That's okay. But I've been really enjoying grabbing like scraps of pattern paper and sort of just chucking them wherever I feel like it. That's cool. Um, but Bright Night's been the one that I've, I've reached for most often. Cool. Yeah. Very cool. I don't know how big a strip I actually want for this. So we start with a centimetre. Yeah. Yeah, why not? Why not? I feel strange measuring centimetres. No, we're so used to doing it. For an imperial sized card with everything else, and I'm like, yep, yeah, I'll have a centimetre strip, that's fine. I feel like I'm like, I can speak both languages. <laughs> but sometimes I speak both languages in a really inconvenient way. So I'll be like, to take uh, a card blank, which is, you know, five and a half by four and a quarter inches, and then add a one centimeter strip. Yeah. Uh -huh. And people are like, listen, pick a lid, Leslie. I was about to say, I'm trying to think how to measure this. Mm -hmm. It's four and a quarter inches. It is. Uh, okay, so I have just scribbled on here with some Copic. That's what I'm doing. Mary says those blue stripes look fabulous, darling. And Laura says, how can you forget the cake? I know, it's actually pretty bad. It's very naughty of me. I wouldn't forget it in real life. I don't think. I think the cake would be high on the agenda in real life. By eucalyptus flavoured cake, I might accidentally leave that one in the fridge to be honest. Leave that one in the fridge. Ha! Funny. <laughs> there we go. I have guesstimated somewhat this strip. And, I'm okay and it works. It. And it works. Right. I'm going to take out a little tray. Well, while you do that, I'm going to steal your misty. All right. Take breathe in. Where's my tray gone to? What's living tray. over here? So that one dish. 
All right, that's me moving it out of the way. Okay, I'm just trying to take all these little leaves and not lose them. I'm going to stick this strip down before I lose it, actually. Speaking of losing things, I'll take the koalas off before I accidentally ink up her card. And there's a great stamp on here that says, wishing you a quality birthday. And that is just obviously what's going to have to happen. Are we done? Are we not going to? Ooh, uh, mm, Aha! Uh -huh. oh, okay, magic. It was me, it was you, Gerardo. Picnic. Mary says, wow, that is a great tree die set. Oh, it is really good fun. And you have these little dice here. You can make a little peek a -poo so much fun and i really like doing the like tree canopy as well it's one of my faves so sure, i'm sure that there just might use it the table is big enough you can leave things i'm so used to not having a big table and i'm like i'm gonna put everything out and leave it all out live in your best oh, that must look really nice and tidy on the camera but you can only see so much and then chaos <laughs> chaos but it's always been like that <laughs> What you don't know can't hurt ya. I'm just going to steal this bit of card yeah. that was in there. I left it there for you on purpose. Oh, but I'm not going to steal that. That's even better. I'm gifted to you. Ashley's here. Hello. So good. That way, tree, that way leaf does not want to come out to play. <laughs> No leaf for you today. I stole him, he's fine. He's out. And let's put this away before I lose him again. Okey pokies. Laura says, pretty sure we're all familiar with the 12 by 12 working space of clear desks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. Right, let's stamp up this cake. I'll steal this before Morgan needs it. That's fine, I'm still, still missing everyone. Actually, it's, ooh, hello. It's one of the advantages of working off of your coffee table is the floor is bonus storage. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> your craft supplies. I can see that in it. And I might actually stamp a little party hat and a present as well. We're situated, ladies and germs. Are they sitting where you want them to sit? Yep, they are now. Yes. Good job, everybody. Mm -hmm. There's a little hat, a little birthday hat, which, you know, you see everywhere in some sets but i don't think they are, get as much love in the real world do you sure i think i think now the only part of hats i can think of that actively get worn are the ones that come out of the christmas crackers yeah and they're completely different shape and style but yeah they're, they're not remotely the same no. but they are also awkward oh, yeah. always there's always one person who they never fit yeah some with an odd shaped head. Or they're all massively big and no one can wear them at yeah, all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then someone's like, oh, I can fix it and tries to like maneuver it and ends up ripping <laughs> it. Yeah. <laughs> and then the first person who stops wearing it, there's always normally women that say, oh, well, so and so's not wearing it, so I'm not wearing it now. My mum did a brilliant oh, thing this year to, to avoid the hat situation. She actually got little headbands. Oh, I really like that yeah, idea. And things on them. They were really cute. That's fun. And they fit because they were just headbands. And yeah. I like that idea. Jacqueline's making uh, a change in the world. Yeah. I think she'd been in the supermarket and some of the staff were wearing them. She's like, I need to know where you got that. Mm -hmm. So we all had our little headbands. Arguably comfier to wear while you're eating than Christmas cracker friends. Yeah. What was on your headband? Uh, Do you recall? 
No, there was there was choices. Oh. And I can't remember which choice I made. I'm sure there was one with like little balls. Mm -hmm. foliage. There was definitely antlers, and there was one, and it was like Santa's legs. <laughs> and like about the, the chimney up the chimney. Yeah. yeah. What was in the other one now? Terrible. Not she's gonna, she's, gonna, watch, she's gonna watch this and then go, it was Pat Morgan. Do you not remember? <laughs> Did you have too much eggnog that you forgot? Oh no, I can't stand eggnog. I knew you were gonna say that. What? No, thank you. Not for me, I'm afraid. Mary's saying those cows and chicks are adorable. Yay! You need to come this way. Oh, I'm, I'm squiffed off to the side of her. I mean, I need to come this way a bit too. What am I buying? I need to put calling them in. Because you're having a moment. Yeah. With me for like last week. Oh, I know. <laughs> Morgan's been ill.com, haven't you? I just, I, you know, like the worst part is that first day when you realise you're not well, and then you think, when am I ever going to be able to breathe normally again? <laughs> I was like, maybe she'll be back tomorrow. Maybe she'll be back tomorrow. No. I'm just going to stop asking her because I think she's <laughs> practically on death store here. And then you got the text yesterday going, I'm coming in tomorrow. And I was like, yeah. Yeah, uh, test perfection, guys. Don't don't recommend getting no, one. Zero out of ten. Yeah, not a great experience. Do not recommend. But I'm using W2s and W5s. We were having a little bit of a chit chat earlier about the new Distress Ink colour, and I know I have spoken a little bit about it in one of our streams before. Um, but Morgan was like, oh, I'm not impressed. I'm, I'm not. Like, oh, I'm, just, I'm just not convinced. All right, well, I'm going to get it, and I'm going to show you the world of grey stuff. <laughs> it's funny about we're both using different tones. Of grey, I know. I don't know. I don't know if it's just because it's not exciting. And as someone who doesn't have, I don't actually own oxides yet. I don't. I, I have my markers. That was my investment. But I don't know if it's one of these things where I'm like, I personally wouldn't buy it because I could have bought like a nice blue or something nice instead. But yeah, I just feel like it's one of these colors that you'd buy last. Oh no, grays, grays are all the way. Because it, it's it's like white and black. It goes with everything. You think of it in that way. True, true, yeah. And I mean, I did buy those markers when we were in Hobby Craft the other week, didn't I? That's right, yeah. You got gray. What greys was it? Uh, they were the cool, cool greys. They were a great bargain. I don't know if it's still on, but I got, I think it was five or six markers all in a packet. How much were they? Do you remember? It was like seventeen forty nine. I want to say. Oh, nice. Because usually it's cult pens that I buy them from. Mm -hmm. But I think I saved, I, did, I think when I looked at it, I actually would save myself like 20p. <laughs> <laughs> I bought them all individually. Um, it does come with a marker thing, but you don't really like the marker. Oh, the liner. The liner. I'm, I'm not got, I don't really get on with it. I find it bleeds, but then I've not tried it on oh, Peppy Doodle MFC, actually. You know. I know, so I know. Could just, it could just be the marker paper that I initially used or I didn't like. But they're handy to have, actually, for yeah. just everyday writing. Absolutely. It's still a pen at the end of the day. How many times do we go, got a pen, got a pen, got a pen? They migrate. Does anyone else oh, have this problem? All the time. But here as well, it's pencils. I'm like, how do I not have a pencil? I found one on my desk. I'm like, that's not mine. That's probably me. <laughs> I probably leave it everywhere. That's why I have no pencils. <laughs> do, do, do. I'm adding a little bit of shading. Shady, shady. I am loving these all guys. They're just so happy and jolly. What is a stereotypically Australian name? Because I need to, I need to give these guys names. My first thought is Steve because of Steve Irwin. <laughs> that is so funny. I was thinking like Brody. It's like a cool surfer name. Really, really. <laughs> no, maybe not. Maybe that's. I don't know. What is a cool surf or a cool um, Australian name? Let us know in the comments. Can you think of a sort of Aussie name? An Aussie name. An Aussie name. <laughs> We're just having one of those Mondays. <laughs> Oh, stop dying over there. Already. Go for a little toner grey belly. Do 
Let me go. Laura says, I've lost my place. Oh no, no. Next time you place an order, let us know and we'll see if we can dig one out for you. Try and track one down. Put it in the comments and the order notes, whatever it's called. It, do you know what? It's actually been quite funny since launching the retired section. Some of the notes that you we got <laughs> people emailing going, Are you sure you don't have any of this left? I'm like, no. Yeah. I know, I'm sorry. Me, I know. I looked. I'm like, Look at every corner. I'm like, yeah, we, we have. <laughs> we have. Go for a nice job. It really did mean it. Once it's gone, it's gone. I know. And there was even an incident where I had to dig one out of my own stash for uh, Jasmine. Oh, they're so cute. Hmm, still stuck on what an Australian name would be. Anyway, let's move on to some leaves. Yeah, no, it's because you've asked me, I can't think that. Yeah. <laughs> the other than the Irwins, I'm like, with Robert. By Liam. Liam's more Irish. Liam. Liam. I think you'd have to say it at two syllables like that. Liam. <laughs> I, can't, I can't. I'm trying to think. Did you ever watch? Kelly? No, I mean a little bit after your time. Are, are you going to say Michael Mermaids? Yeah, I was going to oh say. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say Michael Mermaids. Uh, but what you Chloe? Chloe? No. Cleo. Cleo. <laughs> Oh no, Cleo! The comedy is fine! We're not doing well with this, no humour. Mm -hmm. We're not very good at that. Laura though. says, I've googled popular Aussie names and they're the same as ours. Mm How -hmm. <laughs> disappointing. That is disappointing. Oh well. Okay, so, yeah, that's okay. We'll, we'll call them Cleo. <laughs> and what was the other girl's name? Oh, um, I don't remember. We had the, the day. Um, there was a blonde haired girl. Oh no, I love Michael Mermaids. Piper watched it. I don't know if it's aged very well. Oh, I think it's just really fun. I quite like it. Let us know if you ever watched Michael Mermaids. <laughs> I don't know. H2O. Oh yeah, that's what it was, H2O. Sure. I think it was, H was it not H2 or Michael Mermaids or something. Yeah, like that. something to that effect. Uh, chickens, I better colour my chickens in. <laughs> oh, my cows, they have hair. Cows do have hair. They do. Do, 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 do. Somebody's messaging us both. It's a mound of hair. She is probably telling us, oh, this person has applied to the design team. Oh my um, God, guys. So applications team. are still open. Yeah. If you want to apply to our design team call. But oh. uh, I think we have 172 currently. And this is what I say. I'm very <laughs> glad I delegated this job. <laughs> So, um, yeah, if you don't hear from me or Amanda for a while, it's because we're looking at design team applications. <laughs> and I'm not. <laughs> oh, I'm glad there's a lot, though, because I oh, think it would have been horrible if in, in some sort of alternate reality we looked at it and there was none. Oh, I know. That would be awful. Amy says, how's your dog doing, Leslie? You don't talk about him much. Oh, no, Ranger's still mm -hmm. fine. He's, we've had to shut him out of the room today while we're streaming because of echoes. And, I mean, barks are loud normally. So, I did mention this a little bit on Friday, is that um, when we were downstairs in the, the downstairs craft room, um, he would need to be in the same room as us, so he would always be kind of lurking around, wouldn't he? Lurking, lurking around just living my shadows. Shadows. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and um, now that the craft room is upstairs, we're right next to the bedroom. So he normally like comes in, and then he's like crafting. All right then, and then he goes and lies on the bed because he thinks I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm not doing anything interesting. I'm not going to skip out the front door. He's, there's nothing he's missing out. Yeah, he's like, yeah, I've I've seen this. You just stand at the table and talk to people. It's not that. It's not for me, Mum. There's no there's no chance. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna miss out on going outside. 
This is where he comes and he's like, oh no. <laughs> Just a little paw at the door. No, I do get that sometimes. A little scratch, scratch, scratch. He's a funny dog. He's yeah, a buddy buddy. Chicken, popcorn or chicken? Chicken or love. Or white. Or like a light grey. They could be like a light grey. Actually, chickens could be a lot of colours. Yeah, I have grabbed some yellows though, so we'll see what they, what they look like. Mellow yellow. Journey Coach Jen saying, all I can think of is the Australian movie Muriel's Wedding. You're terrible, Muriel. Amazing. I do not get that. Do you not? We need a movie night where we watch Muriel's Wedding. <laughs> And then the funny thing is, wasn't it, was it Tilda Swinson, whatever her name Swinton, is? Swinton, yeah. And she's quite local there, isn't she? She, I don't know what she's currently is. I know she's got a place just up the road. Not very far from here, yeah. Yeah. I think she was in it. I'm thinking about the same person. Well, a lot of famous people, or their siblings tend to end up rumbling about here for some reason. What siblings? Uh, Ian McGregor brothers here. Oh yeah, but that's he works in the camp, I think, or he did at one point. I don't know if he still works there or not. Wow, well, so brilliant! I am on die cutting duty. Those guys are coming out so cute. I just, I think they're nice to color. Yeah. Also, yeah. I've added some patches on him. Yeah, why not? Because I thought he, he needed a bit of accessorizing. Need a bit of pizzazz. And all that wild. Oh, that's got really dark for some reason. Oh, I think it's time Hello. after a little while. All I can think of is this really movie. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What other names were in that, though? I'm trying to think of what was in Neighbours. Did you ever watch Neighbours oh, no. and Home and Away? There was a Shane. Oh, Kylie. Kylie. Kylie and Jason. Yeah. My Australian accent. I hope nobody <laughs> is actually watching from Australia because they're going to be like, I cannot listen to this. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so this is when we get Ali from the design team going, oh, God. <laughs> Mostly, I'd like to step down from the design team due to blatant uh, abuse of uh, the Australian accent. You know what I love watching though the clips. Of, it's usually actors doing press for whatever movie they're doing. The clips where they do like their their nationalities, like slang. Oh yeah. Some some. Oh, I. You know what they they, they, they mm -hmm. usually give you a minute to guess. Mm -hmm. Some of them are so out there. Even the, the British ones. I'm like, what? What are you trying to what say? Even is that? What does that mean? What even? Right. What am I doing? Die cutting. Die cutting. No, we need scissors. I don't think he's going to fit through the machine. Rude. No, he must have colouring in the flower. That is rude. Oh, dude. We've all been there. Hi. This is still quite damp. I might have to give it a blast. I thought you'd be here, dryer. Well, I you? literally put it away before the stream. Oh, I've got my, well, my, <laughs> I've still I've got my big boy, but he's a bit noisy. But I'll do it under the table. Be right back. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I wish we could show you that Leslie's currently under the desk. <laughs> Change the number three over here. I know. Change the three. Number three. Hey, where is it? There we go. <laughs> Killing me. Back to two. There we go. One, two. Okay. Uh, what did I want? So I don't know what I wanted. I can't wait for my brain to start Sorry, working again. One. I've got a marker. I don't think that's what I went over there for. I've got one. Oh, I'll tell you, it might be a gel pen. There's a gel pen there. White one. Is that what you need? Yeah. Alright. Alright. Blue Ant saying hello from Iowa. Hi. How are you doing? Of course, it's need to set up an under desk cam. <laughs> no, right? Okay, so I'm going to have wishing you a Kowaluti birthday. What colour shall I go for, though? These are my colours. I'm going for a nice, subtle, is that my dog? That might be the dog. Speak of the dog. They've been asking for your ranger. Oh, he's been a diva now. He's been a diva. Oh, hello. 
what time are they not fluffy? Oh, the one time he's like, I'm just going to go and sit in my chair like a good dog. Number three, please. Number three. Hold on. Bear with. Hey, we oh. Hi, buddy. How you doing? Everybody's asking how you doing. Yeah. You mean a good boy? <laughs> I don't know what that looks for. <laughs> Heavy though, aren't you? You're down for it. Not the light dog. Suzanne was saying on Friday that she's only here for. I'm only here for range. <laughs> we, need, we do need a ranger. <laughs> We've got enough cables going around in here. Friends, we don't actually see what we're doing. Oh, you've got it. Oh, I'm getting a loose. So handsome. Yeah, yeah, I really are. Look at that. Not approved, he says. See when you go in to get Catherine Fuller. So expressive. Get free. Get after me. <laughs> That's one of the funniest things. We we it's not out yet and it's still in the editing process, but we did film a craft room tour. <laughs> what, the old, years ago? <laughs> yeah. The old craft room was I think we're just gonna have to film an up to date version and like splice it in and go this yeah. is the before this is the after. Before and after. Um but we did film it. And it was really funny going and I helped Leslie opening up drawers and going, Oh it's a box of chocolates in here. Oh it's empty. <laughs> oh, I must have eaten yeah, not really. <laughs> When they were in the box with all the camera stuff, it was like just an empty box of chocolates. I don't even remember that. But I'm also not surprised. <laughs> and then I was like, ooh, uh, what was it? The Mountain Glass eh? with like yes. candied chestnuts. Also delicious. Yum, yum, yum. But I'm using a pink to stamp my greeting. This is It's a Girl by Catherine Brewer. <laughs> right, I'm going to grab the die cutting machine. Hopefully not cut anyone's squint because it's been so long. <laughs> so make sure you tip it down. He's taped for it. Awesome. Amy's asking, how old is Ranger now? Ranger is four. He was four on the 3rd of January. Oh, he totally moved. That was rude. Oh. Right, reject cow. Oh, no. Okay. He's having a proper sulk now, his old Ranger. He's actually looking the other direction. <laughs> yeah, he's turned right. He's turned right. I'm not looking at them. Okay, I am in the assembly mode. Well, let's see if I can make this happen. First we have a little tree. I'm going to get my bluebird out on the go here. Tiffany says, hello ladies from Wisconsin. Hello. Right. Um, so I've not done a background yet because I'm thinking I'm going to put this on some pattern paper. But we've got a new pattern paper coming out. We've got a new lot of things coming out. Oh, we do, I know. And I actually did a little sneaky peeky of the pattern paper on Friday night stream. So, maybe I just do another little sneaky peeky, because why not? Why not? It is really nice. So, you know, it is pretty, isn't it? Light as well. Yeah. Get the excitement started now. I know. It's really pretty. I love it. Do you want to move while I stick the die on you? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I shall kill you. So this little die cut uh, guy here has actually got internal cut lines in his paws so you can put some like present in his paws. He can be holding it like he's having a little present there. So cute. Love it so much. Let's sort that out. I'm going to add some leaves to my eucalyptus tree now. I've got a hi from Italy in the chat as well. Hello. 
Oh, we're back, Italy. Who's who's saying hi from Italy? I wonder. Uh, Fabiola. Hey, Fabiola. Bonjour. Jan. I want to go to Italy again. I am going to drag King to Italy at some point if it kills me. That's only fair. <laughs> Being as he is of Italian origins, or at least his family is. Has he ever been to Italy? Um, I don't think so. That's rude. I know. I know, it was funny, I actually texted a friend I've not heard from in a while. Uh, well, I'm off sick. And she said, have you managed to book a holiday yet? And I'm like, finally, you should ask that. Yeah. Uh, I'm essentially kidnapping Keenan. Me and, and my papa still are kidnapping our partners and we're going away at the end of this month. Yay! Within Scotland. Also, the same weekend that I'm kidnapping Craig, but I can't tell you about that in case he's listening. <laughs> Lots of kidnapping. That Lots we're going to get banned oh, no. from me again. That's right. We'll have to tell everybody what we mean. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Um, oh, that was Facebook, not YouTube, thankfully. On, on Facebook, somebody <laughs> said, oh, we should do a crafty retreat in the UK. And I was like, yeah, we should. And then someone from one of our American pals, was it Amanda Stevens? I think it was Amanda Stevens. <laughs> was like, oh, I'd love to do that. That would be so good. And I was like, yeah, we'll just come and kidnap you, Amanda. And then I got banned from Facebook. <laughs> I was like, why you banned from Facebook? And uh, they were like, oh, you were talking about inappropriate things. I was like, what does that even mean? And it turns out because I had suggested that we kidnap Amanda. It did, Facebook did not like that no. in the slightest. It was like, so, uh... you, don't, you don't talk about these things? <laughs> okay, sorry. We take it back. We take it back. Right, let's stick some dudes down. Sticking some dudes down. I'll stick them. I'll stick them down. Do you want some glue bear? Uh, I'm just gonna use a tape runner, but yeah, I'll just glue it. Mm -hmm. Haven't got glue all over my hands in a while. I know what you need to do. I'll have to do some of this. Don't even know if I'm working on your camera now. Not used to the whole setup now. Yeah, it does take a little while. Well, facial awareness. Well, I mean, it's not great to begin with. <laughs> Get a little bit of foam tape on his butt. A little bit of foam tape on his butt. Hey, buddy. If I just like, hope you're not talking about me. No foam tape on your butt. Oh, I need to put my sentiment on as well. Oh, yeah, you should put sentiments before you start doing any, anything that's got foam tape on it, eh? Uh, I don't think I'm going to do foam tape today. Oh, yeah. We're going to be, controversial be a, a flat carder today. Yeah. I Just feel like I need to do enamel dots, though. So oh, I'll, yeah, yeah. That'll fix, that'll fix the flatness. Yeah. Right, I'm going to grab... Ooh, that one. Oh, I'm throwing markers at you now. Good. It's gone right by your feet. <laughs> this is why we couldn't have it on your deck, Cam. Yeah. With me kicking it and throwing things constantly. And us standing on the stool to reach the camera settings. Cutie! I love it. This is looking cute. Didn't need these in the end. Um, maybe we'll just put a couple of little leaves down here. So they've got them, you know how it is. Why not? I'm going to grab the Misty actually again. And maybe one over here as well. Whoops, that's too big. Mary says it's so cute how you put the gift there, inserted it. Yay! I think he looks adorable. I think all like the stamps with the little um like internal cut like little hands. Love it. It's my favorite thing. There's actually a really cute reel I saw the other day from Mama Elephant, and mm -hmm. they had one of their stamps. 
mm -hmm. the little dies to the internal cut, internal cut lines. Yeah. And the whole thing was, what, what all could the bunny hold? Oh, cute. What could he hold? Lots of things, presents and cake and balloons. Oh. Yeah. But like our koala here. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm going to have a piece of pattern paper behind this from the new Green Breeze pattern paper. And I was originally thinking this sort of orangey one. Because uh, it kind of goes with the tree. What do you What do you think? Does that work? I like it. I, like I think that. it's nice. We could go for the blue. So I dropped a little scraplet. A scraplet. I think we'll do that. Let's cut this down. Using my trimmer. Hello, that's marked up. Never mind. Yeah. And then these when I when you cut this down, these actually make the perfect little strips to go across your card. Just like what Morgan has done. Yeah. So that's a really good idea on how to use up those little tiny strips. Use them as sort of an anchor point for a card design like this. If I were to be a normal doll. Hello, I found some of Did you find them? Mary then is turning out so nice, adorable cuteness. And Amanda is here. Hey Amanda, <laughs> did your box of goodies arrive? When I was live on Friday, some of our European design team members were going, oh, I'm coloring your stuff. La, 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> um, and yeah, so I'm excited about it. But it's not here. I send you a selfie. Oh, that'll be with that notification. Yeah, we both, <laughs> both got Andy Liddy on our phones, on our watches and whatnot. Top of my nails. There we go. Oh, that works well. I think I've made this a little bit too tall, so I'm going to take out the big paper trimmer. What's your bum sack? No worries. There we go. Lovely, lovely. So what else are we going to add? What are you going to add? Some sparkles. <gasps> you love a spark. It's true. Nobody loves the sparkle more than you. Just because. Yep. I make sure I put this the right way round. Hi there, it's Anna Marie saying hi from California. Hi, I love yeah. the mini punch that you suggest that I get. Thank oh, you. Oh, so cool. Hello, hello. I'm so happy that you got it. Uh, so now I have this all on here. I think I'm going to add a little bit of sparkle to these guys' ears because yeah. I don't want to be under sparkle compared to you. I've been very uh, conservative with my sparkle. You have. Today. You've been very restrained. So proud of you. I'm not going to make him top folding, I think. I like top folding, no card. <laughs> Ears, the top of the candle, and the top of the hat as well. We're back on good terms with ETG. Yes, I fixed it. Craig, um. Oh, squeaky. Craig uh, broke it. <laughs> <laughs> But I mean, he did and he didn't. It was coming to the end, so I think that was part of the problem too. He was like, I didn't figure out until afterwards that there's a trigger. 
Okay. I think I'm pretty much done with perhaps the exception of an ammo dot. I'm going to leave the ammo dots for now. <laughs> I'm not going to. And uh, do that. I say. Are you done? What time is it in the UK? It is 10 to 5. Oh, we've done evening. good. All right. So uh, this is awesome. I love it. We're pretty much finished at the same time. Are you done? That's rare. That is rare. <laughs> that is. Let's zoom in and have a little zoom in. Look, see, look at what we've got. Hold on. I need a stool. I'm going to stand over here. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Piper, or Piper, I'm more than more she is. <laughs> a small child. We've got just the cows and uh, wishing you a quality birthday. Two beautiful pun filled cards uh, with lots of uh, funness. Stripes, finally. And yeah, stripes, yeah. And um, yeah, I love it. And a little bit of sparkle. There you go, you guys. Two really fun cards today. Oh, I can't back down. Ashley says cute cards. Mary says fab. And Laura goes, ooh, new dots. She saw that new dots out of the corner of her eyes there. Maybe. I wasn't quite ready Maybe. To, to release, <laughs> to reveal that one. <laughs> but keep an eye out. We've got, I need to finish the catalog tomorrow. That's going to be the first thing on the agenda, isn't it? Get that sorted. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Right, guys, we're going to leave that there for now. And I'm going to go get Morgan a, um, a drink of water. A cup of tea. A cup of tea actually would be lovely. But thank you very much for joining us yeah. for our lovely cards today. I will be back on Friday for Come Craft With Me. So come on over to Happy Doodle YouTube. Ring the bell so that you're notified when we go live. And if you do have any suggestions or... Um, or even feedback, let us know, please. We'd love to hear from you. Yeah, sure. Pop it in the comments from the video. Yep. Or you can get us on Instagram. It's probably the next best place to get. Yeah. Or the Happy Doodlers Facebook group. Give us a thumbs up. Like the video. It all helps us as well to try and bite the algorithm. Because it's a beast. <laughs> Have a great week, you guys. Happy crafting.